Okay, okay. If you find this box, please call me at telephone number 555-8494. Oh, it's ringing. Oh, goodness. Ah, oh, shucks. It's a message machine. It says, hello, how are you? Have you been all right through all the lonely, lonely nights? Leave a message for Eric Choyer after the beep. <laughs> That's right. That's what the answering machine says. How did you know? Because I'm Eric Troyer. No. You're Eric Troyer of the Electric Light Orchestra Part 2? Indeed. Do you know that I know all of your songs? I bought all your albums. So you're the one. <laughs> Wait a minute. I was just talking to you on the phone, so how did you get here so fast? I've been watching you through these. <laughs> hey, why were you spying on us? Yeah. Well, I wanted to see if you were smart enough and musical enough to follow my treasure map. So I, are you telling me that this uh, treasure map that I fished out of the ocean in a bottle is yours? Yes. And you know what? You are a great fisherman. You should have seen the tennis shoes that I fished out of the ocean. <laughs> One of them fought me for an hour. Those are great. Yeah. But wait a second, wait a second. Mister, you're saying that that treasure chest is yours. Well, no, now it's yours. Oh, hurry up, ah. open it. I meant it for whomever found it. What's in it? Well, this is my first guitar. Oh! Oh, you made it! My first drum. You broke it. My first song. You wrote it? I wrote it. Oh. Oh, I love this stuff. Thank you so much. Great, yeah. You know, I hate to say this, Mr. Sawyer. That's Troyer. Whatever. But, you know, this treasure of yours is really... junk. Hey, well, you know, it all depends on how you look at it. What are you talking about? Everyone feels that certain things are special to them, even if they may not mean anything to other people. Yeah, that's right. So the stuff you call junk, it happens to be my old toys when I was a kid, my old musical instrument toys. Mm -hmm. And when I could play real instruments, yeah. my mother wanted to throw them all away. No. Uh. So, rather than lose my favorite things... Ah, I put them in a box, buried them in the sand, and threw the map into the sea. So that someday, kids like you might find them and love them and enjoy them like I do. Oh, and I found it, and I love them, and I thank you so much. And you know what? Here's a special one for you, Mr. Fisher Puppy. <gasps> oh, thank you. know that you knew seesaw marjorie Daw. oh yes you know that's how we knew where to dig for the treasure well who told you the sand lady yeah sand lady yeah, yeah. oh yeah she lives on the beach you know sand she helped lady. us find the treasure and i really wish that we could share some of this stuff with her well why don't you well i don't know where she is would you like me to give it to her you know where she is oh i know everything about her Mr. Sawyer, Troyer, Troyer, uh, did I happen to tell you that I also love this stuff? Uh, no, you didn't. Yeah, but, yeah so are but, there any more of the good one, huh? No, I gave that one to Hush. Why? Well, Hush knows that the best treasures are not found in a pirate's chest. What do you mean? Well, their memories, their music, and the friends you make.
And the melody lingers on But what good are all nature's treasures Without someone to share them with too Oh, we have the sun and the beach and the music But best of 